everybody. This is Sally with Vintage Discoveries and some more vintage jewelry. Just sorting some stuff out. Um, I feel sad about this necklace because it's not in good shape. It's got a lot of cruddiness, but it is... Um, Sopada. <sighs> but like I said, if somebody could clean it up, it's very dull and dirty. And it's got some wear. Well, not really wear, it's just not in the greatest of shape. But it's really pretty. So I'm going to put it... Um, in the craft. This I always really liked for some reason. It's really different, but you can see what kind of shape it's in. It's so loud. Um, it's weird, right? It's going in the craft, but it is kind of cool. And this is cute. Oh, my big chunky nails. I can't get it open. But it's not in bad shape. I mean, it's, it's vintage. You know what I mean? I don't think it has anything in it. And I think it does open Ugh, every nail's. So that can go in the wearable. This isn't a bad looking ring, but it's got some a little beat up, but it's pretty. So it's on the craft. <laughs> Sorry, hiccup. This is pretty. It could be wearable. An earring. I think it says something like ever so faintly, maybe? Right? Are you saying that? Or is it just me? It says something. It's just really, really faint. You think they would put it? That's so crazy. <coughs> Sorry. Tickle. This is cute. It's wearable. This looks like it belongs to one of the um, stick pins. I'll have to look. These are wearable. Oh, September 11th. Um, I don't know what that is. It's a cute little pendant thing. Wrapped up in a cruddy silver tone. This is from some sort of museum. It's got that. Some sort of museum piece. So. Why? It's just plain old chains. Why you gotta be difficult? Because that one's closed, right? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Someone asked me, asked me for chains. 
So I guess the ones that aren't being used, I'll put to the side. I know I have a ton to change somewhere, but because I was putting them to the side so I could have them to use for other stuff. This is wearable. If you want to see what it says. Oh, the Vatican Library. I guess that's not really a museum, but. And it was something. It was cute. Small but wearable. This one, I have no idea what the marking is. Maybe somebody knows. It has an XP. And then this weird, I don't know if you can see it, it's really small. Get in there. Oh, there's my nail. Can you see it? No. Now you can. Oh, Lord. All right, never mind. I don't know what that is. Is that an angel or something? No idea. And I looked at it up close. Well, let me know what you know. This is a broken belt buckle. But it's cool. I think they're playing cards. What do you think? That's what I gather. So that's gonna go into crafts. It's very heavy. Really, really heavy. Oh, did this belong to something on here? Possibly. This is a cute uh, clamper. I'm gonna put in the wearable. This has a cool chain on it. Let's go with wearable. This is vintage. It's got the spring ring and it is on a chain. So that's good old vintage right there. I had something else to look through. No idea. Mm -hmm. Now, we went through one case, right? And this is, I think, is going to go in the craft. Yeah, there's a lot of craft in here. Uh, so that's gonna fill that up. Ooh, ooh, yeah. Ooh, 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 ooh. This is good for crafting. But I got it tangled, sorry. I think that's, this is pretty too. It's a broken um, thing though. So that's a vintage button. And this is really cool. So if you can fix that up. Peking glass, that's the name of it. Okay, that's gonna go in the craft lot, that's, should I put this watch? And no, okay. So let's put one, let's put some more stuff in there. Craft lot. 
all this stuff is going to go in another craft lot. This has some really cool um, beads on it. I think it's Japan. Look at this. They're like sugared in the middle. They got the old glass Oro Borealis. So that's going to be another. I got to make another bag of a box up. That's going to go in. Oh, this is going to go in another box. Well, it's going to go in with this stuff. So, once I put that small flat rate box together, then I can throw it in there. I've got so many, as you probably remember, um, whatchamacallits, the uh, stick pens. I'm wondering, should I put some in my booth? I wish this didn't have pen on it because this is on its original thing. So it's gonna have to go into crafts because honestly, it's really pretty cruddy, so. Oh, this. This was, looks like somebody, it doesn't look like it came that way. I thought it had a name on it, but it was kind of just beat up like somebody crimped it together. So it's pretty much crafts. So I was thinking to put some of these in the wearable lot and then put some in my, my booth. And it's funny because I was just talking about uh, cloisonne, and this really, it's really not, you know, it's more of just metal with some enameling over it. So that's a bummer, but I have a lot. I don't know why I keep this bird around because he just freaks me out. I really don't even want to put him in a craft lot because he's just deteriorating, poor thing. This is going to go in the craft lot because it got beat up. Look at this adorable ring. I don't know why I love it. Isn't it so sweet? The adjustable little thing. It's so sweet. Like a little ceramic piece or something. Yeah. Oh, this isn't a stick pin, but... This thing is beautiful. I think it's beautiful. I think the stones are really pretty. Do you think it should be in my booth? Is somebody gonna notice it? Is it eye-catching enough? That's my question. So, if anybody wants any stick pins, oh my gosh, I'm blinding with my nails. Oh, remember this was the uh, medieval weapon or the corona. Yuck. So I think I'll put some, maybe some, some of my favorite, like the cute ones that I like, I'll put in the booth and then, um, or well, maybe I should put a bunch in like one price. I don't know. We'll see. I haven't sold anything today. I looked. There's a website we can go on and check. And it's just that Sunday was the one hurrah. But then again, you know, Sunday is Sunday and Monday is Monday. You know what I mean? This is really pretty. I think it's hand painted. And it's Lennox. But is anybody going to look at that in a booth? I don't know. I mean, it's not a booth. It's just a case, you know, a locked case with glass doors on it. So I don't know. I got to make a decision about those. And I might, maybe I'll just see how they go. Like stick a whole bunch together and for one price. 
That sounds good, right? I have all these containers that I have to empty. This is pretty shoe clip. I think I only have one though. So one. So I guess, I don't know, crafts then? I have these beauties, nice big round moon glow. Sterling? Oh my gosh, they are. That's crazy. Who doesn't love some moon glow? The white is pretty, but yeah, I prefer something more colorful. But they are really pretty. But I don't think anybody's looking for that. You know, as far as like, but you never know, you know. I can't make assumptions. I really can't. Oh, don't tell me I have more. Can't assume. You know what they say. There's a name for this. It's something specific. Florida. Is it some sort of Shell or rock? I don't know. I haven't looked in here forever. Well, there's a shell. I mean, shells are cool. This has just too much glue on it, but so I can go in the crafts. But shells, I mean, they're really a beautiful thing when you think about it. And very old. Kansas, right? Is that what that says? Is this for the group Kansas? Oh, I gotta research that. That's, this is um, that German, the Edelweiss, right? Flower. It says something. Am I making you crazy? Because I'm making myself crazy. Jay Riller? Jay Reiner? I don't know. This is enamel. Cute little enamel. This has wear on it. Bloop. What else we got? We just pour it out. Oh, this is a lot of like um, this stuff. Is that say Raphael? Raphaelian? Nice eagle. Nice eagle. This can go in a craft. Yeah, a whole bunch of... Uh, this just looks dangerous. That's cute. These things um, that I'm not sure... 100%, but I should probably just like, maybe I can lock them up or something. I think people still buy um, like the Rotary Club things and all that. This is what this is. I could definitely lock those up and see what happens. 
with that. I have a hard time parting with those little pins and stuff, and I don't know why. Uh, there goes one on the floor. There goes one on the floor. I don't know what this is. No clue. CWA. See what I mean? There's a bunch of them, and it's like, so what are you gonna do with them? What are you gonna do? SFD Slatington. Newark. I don't know if it's in Newark or it's just the name of the company. This is cool. My nails are too sparkly. Oh, this thing is too shiny. You're blinding me. Oh, that, I think that's that Aston or something like that. Foster? I don't know. It's cool, though. Look at that. It's like a stoplight. Looks like it's lit up. Oh, these little tchotchke things. <gasps> oh my goodness, I didn't know I had more of this stuff. Remember I went through all the religious stuff? It's a men's thing. What is this? Faith. Oh, more religious stuff. I have plenty of these. That one is a little gunked up. One of those. That's pretty. Got a nice vintage look to it. Well, this is really pretty. Oh, that's nice. Nicely done. <gasps> oh, that's pretty too. It's not marked. Isn't that funny? Maybe it's marked on the inside. That's really pretty. No, it's just textured. If it says something, I cannot read it. I love it with the enamel. It's so pretty. I forgot I had these. <laughs> Is that the Girl Scout thingy or a Boy Scout thingy? Pretty hands. Nice big cross. That's different. I don't have one of those. I mean, I haven't had one of those. I love the bubble ones. I don't know why. I love the little three of it. See, this is cool too. I I don't have any duplicates of that. Not. Oh, look, the little enamel one. Purdy. I wonder if I should lock those up. What do you think? Yeah, it would be good to get rid of some of this stuff that I have in these cases. I'm going to put the Christmas stuff to the side. Craft. What to keep and what not to keep. How many Christmas trees can you have? It's kind of beat up. Oh, this is such a cute enamel one. Look at him. Look how Santa looks so happy. Let's see what it says. Uh, 1978. I don't know. 
Can anybody read that? Can anybody help me? It says... Blah, blah, blah. I don't know. Commodore, con, blah, 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 something. But he is so cute. He's so cute. He's got some wear at the bottom. But I don't know. Just makes me happy. And you're going to have to go in the craft because I do see some wear at the bottom. But I do love them. A pineapple. Anybody in need of a pineapple that has like a seven on the back? I don't know what that means. Craft is. I know what that means. Craft. So. Okay. All right. Oh, these earrings. These are pretty. Look at these. You can't tell maybe from the picture, but they are mother of pearl. And you see the you see some of the, the light coming through. Clips. Pretty, right? Beautiful. And the wearable. Look at these. That's a little green at the bottom. Are they missing any stones? They need to be cleaned. Bogoff. Bo, I think it's B, B O G O F F. Yeah, that's that color green is not um, the bad bad one. That's just needs to be cleaned up. But these are pretty. I gotta look up the name. It's not striking me. This I probably saved because I probably have something that doesn't have one. Christmas in July. Okay. I see these a lot, right? They're like... Oh, it does have a name. JJ. It's like that screen or something. Oh, it has an animal. That's pretty. Oh, American Santa. Uh... Oh, it's a crab. I'm like, what is that? <laughs> Why did they put a crab in with the Christmas stuff? The world may never know. Classic, right? Christmas tree earring. Isn't that cute? Reminds me of a little cookie. Cute. This is going to the craft because it's worn. This is missing some stones. Yeah, I mean, I love, I love Christmas. I love that season. Fades across and, ah, you know, I'm not tired of summer yet. This is pretty. So not really in the mood. It's got a lot of gunky glue. I think when I started with the bags, oh, this has sparkles. You know, I, I, I didn't know how to separate. There were so many categories, so I bought things to put it in, the containers, and it's just got to the point where it's like, <sighs> just put it somewhere, you know? Wooden. Oh, that 
can go in the craft. Oh, craft. These are cute. Wait. That's very vintage. I like it. It's cute. So I got to put all the Christmas stuff in one spot. So when I know when it gets close, I can access it. Oh, here's more men's stuff. Yeah. There's got to be a desire for this. Eventually. What's this doing in here? men's stuff is cool. I just wish it would come back in style and I wish I could repurpose it maybe or somebody would like to repurpose. I find that I mean I do sell these sometimes. It has to be like a specific theme. Like this one is something. I don't know what it is. You know what I mean? Like for different groups or um the military or things like that so i mean i have sold them i can't say i have it hey christmas oh i know what this is i was gonna wear this to my daughter's school and embarrass her i love pta i'm assuming they mean the parent teacher association so i don't know if it means something else but still might hold on to this because she's uh only in ninth grade so I could still, I could still use that. Oh, puffy tree. My own problem is it's worn. It's got no star. That's cute. That looks like Hallmark, something Hallmark would have. Hallmark, yep, doesn't have a date on it though. I heard um, Hallmark Channel had Christmas in July. With all Christmas stuff on. Not sure. I just missed a little green thing. Not sure I can get into it right now. I mean, I love it, but come on. With the air condition blowing on you. That's got wear. Oh, this is on a little thing. Cute. Pretty. You know? Not sure I can get into it. Oh, is that like, well, they're not ugly sweaters. Hey, well, at least I kept Christmas together, right? Well, I know there's other Christmas stuff somewhere. Oh, I've seen this before. Glass snowflake. That's pretty. I think this is cool. It's kind of wrapped around it. You. It's gonna have to craft. That glue is just too much for me. This got any missing stones? No. It's a little bit worn, but it's kind of cute. Presents. What do you think? He's cute. Candy cane. That's a pretty candy cane. I love candy canes. Stone, stone, stone. I think it has all the stones. I regret that one Christmas tree I got. Oh my gosh, what was it? Oh, it is, it, I think it might have been Weiss. It's sold, I put it on eBay, it's sold immediately, and then I had seller's remorse because it was so beautiful. This is cute. I've sold quite a bit of Christmas trees, actually. They all seem to sell. Oh, I love these little enamely things. Angel for 2000 craft 
Now I'm going to put all this Christmas stuff away. Eek. Oh, look how little him is. Wait. Yeah, I'm going to go and craft so we can do maybe something cute with that. I hope I have no more Christmas stuff. See, this is cool. I kept this thinking I'm going to put it in something because I was saving all of those like cameo and brooch um, thingies that were empty. This is really neat. It's going to go in the craft. These are vintage hair things, right? You just choo -choo. Put them in the hair. Are they wearable? Mm. Ooh. I don't know what to do with these. Are they craft? I don't know. I'm gonna craft. I mean, I'm not gonna craft, but I put them in a craft. All right, that's it for tonight. The Christmas, you know, did me in. I'm done. <laughs> but, yeah. I'm going to continue every day to put more and more and more and more together. I would love to just do the medium flat rate, the big, huge ones, and put everything. But just lugging them uh, is not in the cards right now to the post office. And you can only put a certain amount out for the postal person to take. So for right now, we're going to do the small ones. That's what we're going to do. But thanks for watching and subscribing and thumbs up. I forget to say that. And share. I don't know if you can share it. I always say share, but if you can, that would be great. Um, and email me if you have any questions. Vintage.discoveries21 at gmail.com. And... Uh, if I don't answer you right away, it's because I'm working. But um, this week i working only 12 hours instead of 14. So that's cool. Uh, but I will get to it eventually, I promise. And if I didn't, I apologize. But have a good night. And thanks for watching. Talk to you soon. Bye.